NASA reports that by the year 2035, every U.S. coastline will experience more high tide floods, also called nuisance floods or sunny day floods, when the moon's rotational cycle will amplify rising sea levels caused by climate change. In half of the moon's 18.6 year cycle, Earth's regular daily tides are suppressed, so high tides are lower than normal, and low tides are higher than normal. In the other half of the cycle, tides are amplified, so high tides get higher and low tides get lower. Global sea level rise pushes high tides in only one direction, higher. So half of the 18.6 year lunar cycle decreases the effect of sea level rise on high tides, and the other half increases the effect. NASA says the moon is currently actually in this tide amplifying part of its cycle. However, along most U.S. coastlines, this lunar boost has not really made high tides higher than in the past. But NASA warns it will be a different story the next time the cycle comes around to amplify tides again in the mid-2030s. Because then, global sea level rise would have been at work for another decade.